Welcome to my couch in my humble home in the city of Pickering, in the province of Ontario, in the lovely country of Canada. And today we have someone on the show chatting with us all the way from awesome Great Britain. Uh, isn't it wonderful how we can connect across oceans? And connections are something we need uh, even more so in these times of a pandemic. I am your host, Antoine, and this is my co-host, Cowboy. You all seen him on the last few episodes of this shorter version of our LGBTQ talk show. We're calling this one, I Will Survive, a quick chat on the virtual couch while we take a break from filming season six. My guest today, we had on the show before. I am a huge fan of this brilliant artist. Since, odd, uh, since the time at the age of 18 or 19, I believe, he wowed the audience, the world, and Simon Cowell, no less, on the Britain Got Talent, uh, who went on to call him one of the best voices in the world. Uh, since then, and in a very short time, he's done so much and garnered devoted fans across the globe. My guest is Jonathan Antoine. Let me bring him on. Hi. Hello, hey. Jonathan. Hello, hello. hello. It's, it's a you? pleasure to be here. I'm great. I'm great. How are you? How are you keeping? I am doing awesome. I've been keeping safe. Uh, missing yep. my family. I've, I have been, uh, I've been trying to keep a distance. Uh, working from home. All, all, the stif- all the stuff that we're advised to do. Yeah. I've been, yeah. I've been a good boy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, trying, trying our best. It's, it's, it's very strange right now because I've been living this way for the past sort of, you know, 24 years. <laughs> so, <laughs> yeah, it's, but it's not having the option to go out and do stuff is very strange. Isn't it funny when you, when um, I'm, at, I'm also actually usually a very quiet person, but when you're told not to do it, <laughs> immediately you want to do it yeah but as soon yeah, as you told not to why are you telling me not, not to go out i want to go out <laughs> yeah yeah, uh, yeah but of course we've got so to we've got to respect the rules start, beautiful let's start with um with with a little bit about you tell me um, um not the work tell me about you personally a little introduction to jonathan um i'm just a a, a 25 year old kid who uh, really loves to sing that's 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 as as nutshell as you can get it uh, in in as few words as possible. Um, uh-huh. In reality, I'm I'm pretty complicated. I, I have my ups and downs, and um, yeah, I have a lot of things that I I believe in and that I would fight for. Um, I'm I'm as complex as any any human being that you'll find on the street. <laughs> Are you, uh, and you're very talented. So uh, oh, you were you. born and raised in England. I was yes. I still uh, am. You- when did you go on Britain Got Talent? Correct me on the eighteen um, or nineteen. Uh, two thousand twelve. I think I was seventeen actually. Seventeen. Even younger. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> Just yeah, I was practically a baby, right? You were like, a kid back then. Cool. Thinking, and, and it was it was a great experience from everything yeah. that we've seen. Yeah, yeah. It's it's the the platform from which I've been able to to launch everything I've done from then. Um, yeah, and I've. Thank- I've it, since, yeah. since then, then since then, things got crazy, right? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Non-stop. It's just been one thing after another, and I, uh, I love every second of it. Beautiful. Um, last time we touched on the last interview we did uh, that you're an ally of the, the LGBT community. Oh yeah. Um, uh, um, what does allyship mean to you? I just want to expand on that. Um. I mean, at a very simple level, it just means giving every single person the exact same respect that I would expect from them and treating every person as though they are what they are, which is a person, regardless of the the minor differences, you know, people are, are, are different races, different colors, different preferences, different sexual preferences. We're all people and we all have to, particularly in these times, I think people are beginning to see that ever, uh, you know, ever so slightly more as we realize that we can't do this alone as a human race, everything that we want to accomplish and we need to accomplish, getting through this virus, it can't be done by one group of people. It can't be done by one person. It must be done by all of us. Beautiful. You're a good guy. Thank you. (laughs) It's it's just the truth. And that's that's what will set us free as well. 
<laughs> it will set us, it set us free to understand that we're all humans and we all deserve respect and love. Beautiful. Um, I know you love um, singing and music. So uh, tell me, let's talk about work. Tell me about the last thing you've worked on or you're working on. I'm really curious about your album. Is yeah, album? so... Uh, it's it's in limbo a little bit. It's it's out digitally in America and it's coming out on Friday in CD in America, but then it's out in everywhere else in May. So it's it's in that state of releasing, which I think having it released slowly has been really good during this period because people are steadily, you know, uh, enjoying it. But it's not, you know, all at once. It's it's a okay. very interesting thing. Um, can I find but it it's, on it, uh, iTunes? Or? Yeah, you can find it everywhere that good music is available. So okay. iTunes, uh, Amazon, Spotify. Uh, you, you know, I'll be going to buy it in two seconds, right? Oh, don't don't worry. You're, you're, you're getting a free copy. <laughs> <laughs> really don't free. worry. Uh, no, I'm... Uh, I've, I've been a good consumer of your iTunes. <laughs> posts, so. I really appreciate that. It, you know, it, it yeah, obviously it helps. Posted, you're not on my personal wall on Facebook, but I posted before. <laughs> uh, one of my most relaxing things is to throw on Jonathan Antoine's playlist while I'm cooking or getting ready for my evening. It's very relaxing. <laughs> oh, that's wonderful. Thank you. Oh, Thank you. you. Are welcome. I, I, I tell the truth. <laughs> yeah. yeah, that's what it's all uh, about. Well, we talk about music. So tell me something about interesting about what you do, about music, about why you do what you do. Um, I think I think that why why anyone makes anything is possibly one of the most interesting questions that that can be asked of of people. What what is it that drives anyone to create anything? Some some people have like a profit motive behind what they make, and they're you know they're making things for the people for you know so that l people's lives can be improved but to to make music to make art is very strange because it's a very selfish endeavor right because i i make it because i love it i i sing songs because i love to do it and it's almost like the the joy that it brings other people is like is a byproduct um but in, in ways it's all it's become part of that reason as well it's it's very sh it, yeah it's a hard thing to describe the pull of of the artist like you are drawn incessantly to to make things and it feels as though it feels like breathing or or yeah just it feels like breathing as natural as that you you want to create stuff so yeah that's that's one interesting thing is the fact that it's it's yeah it's nebulous there is no you know there's no great force there's no great reason it's just what i have to do I, I, I really love what you say. I, I think I shared with you maybe on a message on so on on Instagram or something that I am I am thinking uh, or I am about to record a cover album of my uh, favorite yeah, yeah. song from my teen years, and I don't know why I'm doing it except that I like singing when I'm not doing anything. <laughs> so I want to yeah. record it because you want to. Um, that, that's a that desire thing. that desire is is one of the most pure and human things it's part of that human condition uh yeah the, the desire to do something time, a, friend, a friend of mine who's a well-known singer in 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 canada mm -hmm. said to me that if you're doing it for money or fame that's the wrong reason uh but if you're doing it because because you love the song that's the great that's, that's the best start to start from absolutely that's yeah that's that's the plain truth i mean yeah. if if you look out there i'm sure you can find many people who are in it for less for than fame. less than yeah. wholesome reasons yeah but they they still want to do it and what 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 can you say but bravo to them bravo of course um well let's get philosophical with you tell me something <laughs> insightful uh, and you you are you're very deep for your <laughs> i'm gonna say for your age but uh uh, you're very deep. Tell me something Thank insightful you. about life. Jonathan, um, Jonathan wisdom about life. Oh, goodness, where do I start? Um, there are a lot of, there are, there are a lot of interesting things that I like phenomena that you can, you can see all around you. I mean, for me, just to open a window every day and look outside and see that people are still living their lives despite, you know, the, the hardship, the tragedy that exists in the world. That's one of the most inspiring things that exists on our planet today. That's one thing. Um, and the other thing is the idea of understanding what goes into making something. When, when someone is, is trying to create something, it's not just you, you, you dream it and it's there. There are 
you know, millions of processes that go into creating any given thing that you see around you. If you look around the room right now, you will see something that has gone through thousands of refinements to become what it is today. Over the course of hundreds and thousands of years, uh, as we have developed as a society to create things that make our lives better. Um, and understanding the story behind things, I think, well, will, will overall help us understand each other better. That's a very, that's a, that's a very cool uh, place you went. <laughs> I, Thank I, you. I, 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 <laughs> Thank I really you. like that insight. Um, how are you, uh, speaking of challenges, how are you spending your time during our physical distancing? What are you doing? Yeah. Um, as I, I sort of alluded to it earlier, but I, I've been, you know, distancing myself from people for 20, 24, 25 years. So uh, I, I've, I, I know this sort of staying indoors and, and being, a bit of a recluse it's it comes naturally to me what i i worry of course for the people who are more naturally inclined to uh social interaction and who love to go out and be near people i i stress for them i worry for them because uh a lot of those people are very important in fact all people are very important in all of their different facets in life and their opinions and how they feel about going out so have you been, have you been able to see um your team your family your no no thankfully most of my team is is american so it's you know we already <laughs> don't have much of that luxury but i i live with most of my family i live with my mum, dad and sister so okay. i i have them to support me so i i'm in an okay. extremely privileged lucky position um you, you, got, so, yeah. you got you got you got a lot, a lot of support around you That's yeah so all of my brain power regarding this is is going to the people who are really affected and it, it worries me of course um but what th that's another thing what can an individual do other than what we're already doing doing the, the social distancing uh, and letting other people be aware that it's you know the right thing to do yeah okay yeah uh, well i'm going to um i'm gonna do this to you i <laughs> every, every guest on this uh version of the show to give us their best try at singing I Will Survive. And please, you are supposed to be the best voice in the world. So this is going to be a really treat. Oh, good. <coughs> Under um, a lot of pressure. <laughs> wow, what's, what's the key? What's a good key? Uh, <laughs> um, let me just, let me get my bearings. Take your time. At first I was afraid, I was petrified, I thought that I could never live without you by my side. <coughs> I don't, oh god, I'm, I'm messing it up. I grew strong, I learned how to get along, I know that I, oh I will god. survive. Yeah, <laughs> doing it in too That's high of a key, really but I gave it a go. <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. I love you for doing that. Thank you. Oh, it's great to talk to you. Thank you. I love um, you too, buddy. That's 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 the that's the extent of this short version. Yeah. Uh, uh, it's been. Uh, uh, we're going to say our goodbyes, but um, everyone, our past full episodes of the show are on YouTube. Uh, the Jonathan Antoine episode is there, so take a look at that one. We recorded that one when he was in. Uh, in Toronto last year, uh, doing a fantastic concert at oh, thank you. Winter Garden Theatre. I hear you're coming back. I will be. I will be. Things are very uncertain, as we all know. Right. Uh, the the yeah. plan is sort of October time, but it's it's very hard to it say. It was October. Uh, a fan of yours actually commented on something that I posted and said, "Watch for him in October." It's like, oh my god, <laughs> I did not know he's coming back. Cool. They know everything. They know everything about me. It's uh, crazy. Your fans are upset, man. I love them. I love them. They are. They're, they're what lets me keep this going. They are uh, the most dedicated, are, beautiful I people. I have to say, you have from from my experience, you have some of the best fans. They uh, comment and follow you. And God forbid, I post anything about Jonathan Antoine. Every <laughs> they, must, they must have tracking devices. Of yeah, right. Anybody mentioning Jonathan. <laughs> uh, yeah right it's it's uh, i would i would absolutely agree with you that i do i do have the best fans actually <laughs> yeah, uh, i love them hey to the fans we love you <laughs> we love you oh uh, I, we we were we were we were so busy being philosophical i forgot i i you know i have an album coming out i have the tv show there are lots of things i'm doing 
if you're watching this, you can go watch or listen to those. <laughs> I, I will take some information from you to, to add to the description right. of, of the video. I'll awesome. have to connect with you. Um, everyone also, so um, uh, yeah, watch YouTube, uh, subscribe to our channel, like us on, uh, on Facebook. It's facebook.com. Visit us on the couch and feel free to share the love. Uh, by the way, when you when I am wearing uh, uh, the, out, the my my wardrobe today is from God Style, our wardrobe provider. So when they get back in business, make sure to support them. Jonathan, last words to to the viewers and to your fans and to everyone. Uh, I I'll try not to take too many. Um, <laughs> just uh, love each other for for now at least. Um, put up with with the things that that might bother you and and love each other just for this moment while we all heal from this please so that's that's beautiful okay with that with lots of love everyone goodbye for now take care of yourselves and of others and see you soon see you soon everyone